be swapping out the condenser fan motor on this uh, no name split system heat pump here. Uh, that literally doesn't have a brand name on it, so a funky old disconnect. Probably the unit seems newer than the disconnect, but uh, I did a little bit of work to this unit before I replaced the uh, capacitor and contactor. So. Oh yeah, scoop some of these leaves out of here, just while I'm in here. This motor definitely has a longer shaft. No big deal though, I cut it down if I need to. I'm sure I've shown this one in a, a video or two before. This the aptly named Ultimate Puller works very well. Uh, I always uh, lubricate the threads, a little drop of uh, something on there every time I use it. Treated it well and it's worked for, for years. Uh, you can use it on centered hubs like this or it has uh, little hooks in there. That you can use it kind of like a, a jawed puller or whatever, a three jaw puller or whatever. So. Um, that should come off there. This shaft isn't real rusty or anything, so let's spin this down and uh, crank on it with the ratcheting wrench for a minute, the gear wrench, and it should come right off of there. Oh, look at that. I thought I was just getting it set, pulled it off of there effortless. So I asked the homeowner to turn the unit on, so we'll see if it comes on here in a minute. Not sure if I got the rotation right, but I got the wires up here so I can swap them out. I'll uh, zip tie them off once I'm done. Well, so it's just the air 